All right, I'm here with Ming Chen from Comic Book Comic Men. Comic Book Men, right here in Miami at UltraCon. That's awesome. So tell me on your YouTube channel. Yeah. I, I'm, I'm going to subscribe. I'm going to subscribe right now. He's a subscriber. Tell me what it's about. To toned in ENT right okay. now. And it's basically just about having fun. Okay. It's about fun stuff. It's about going to cons. So it's I just that toned, uh, let's spell it T O N E D. E D. E D toned in. And then ENT. ENT. Let's see if it comes up here. It should. Oh, there yeah, there it is. And look, I have subscribed. I've got I a new subscriber right, right, right here, now. I've subscribed. I will get notifications when you post a new episode. Hopefully, the next one has me in it, and I'll get the notification. Subscribe, everybody. Be like, be cool like me, Ming Chen from Comic Book Man, Toned In Entertainment. There you go. That's awesome. Which one's your most uh, popular video here? Uh, it's a video from, I think, uh, Thailand. Uh, okay, you love yeah, I don't know. This. The movie reviews the movie are cool. Movie, say, we went to the Save by the Max uh, pop-up restaurant. Oh, in it's LA. Great. I wanted to go. How was it? It was really cool. Okay. It, was, it was like being thrown back on the TV show Save by That's the Max. That's cool. All right, Preppy. Yeah, like, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I did go to Zach Morris. Did too. you? Yes. Are you, do you consider yourself the Zach Morris if you were to pick? Uh, I think a, I think AC Slater. Slater? I, I, I played football in, in high nice. school. Nice. All right, yeah, I mean, I want to be, I want, I think I'm Zach Morris, but I'm more of a screech for sure. Oh, no. <laughs> right, yeah, I'm really more of a Lisa Turtle when all, when all is said and done. Lisa Turtle, okay. Which, which is cool. What what was it about that show, do you think? Because it was so corny, it, and um, but I think it was just safe, and um, it appealed to everybody, I think. Even me, and when I woke up on Saturday, it come out a little later, I guess, like 10 or 11. It's like 11, 11 30 yeah, almost. And, yeah. and uh, I think, yeah, every kid I knew saw that. Every, yeah. Um, yeah, everybody that I knew in my, you know, I, I'm old, but everybody I know, well, like, my probably about saw the it. same age. Yeah. So, uh, I think Saved by the Bell, it was weird. It was on the same time as, like, maybe 90210. Right, yep. So you had, like, more edgy stuff that people watch, but yeah. yet people watch Saved by the Bell, but they didn't really talk about it so much, I think. Yeah, but I remember... Uh, but now like, everybody says, oh, I watch Saved by the Bell back right, in the day. Right, everybody knows uh, there's no hope in dope, like, right? Right, right, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you know, you don't want to do the oil under the school, because no. you don't want to get Becky the right. dog, nope. you know, covered in oil, you know, but... Yeah, yeah. Was it Johnny Dakota? That yep, was no Johnny Dakota, yep, there's no, no hope, hope in dope, dope. man. Yeah. He, was a, he was a hypocrite, man. He was, because he was smoking dope yeah. in, the, in the bathroom, but yeah. they called off the commercial right and they said they couldn't do it so they weren't hypocrites yeah in, in ironically now in Bayside California it's legal ironically that's now, true so there so could be hope for dope there's, out well, there. there's definitely hope for dope because they're making a lot of money uh, <laughs> selling dope California, in California right yeah. now and uh, you know and paying their taxes and, and bettering their schools and everything so yeah, there's yeah. Definitely some that's hope awesome out there. so I noticed your shirt Oh, Wonder Twins. Wonder Twins. Will we ever see them in a movie? I think we should. I mean, they brought the comic book back yep, yep, recently, yep. and they were just such a like a secondary character back in the day. They were just there on the was the Super Friends. Yeah, but they were always kind of the comic relief. I feel with Gleek, uh, especially with Gleek, Gleek yeah. uh, and the Super Friends. Yeah. So, and I think um, I, the the technology, the CGI technology works where you can form them into a some kind of water based uh, <laughs> weapon or whatever, right. and then an animal. So. I want to see this. What weapon do you think the Wonder Twins should transform their powers into? Like to kill like Thanos? Yeah, if they were going to go I mean, is there a water-based, like, I don't know, man. There's, yeah. It seems like, well, if you aim for the heads, I mean, like another Stormbreaker, <laughs> like a water-based Stormbreaker, okay. like made out of ice, you aim for the head, yeah. that could work. That could work, yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> well, what's, uh, last question here, yeah. you know, I know you're a busy guy, so, and I'm, I appreciate you giving me some time to of ask course. a few questions here at UltraCon. You're going to cons now. I love cons. You know, you were on the TV show, Comic Book Man. I love being on TV. You know, how has your life changed <laughs> since doing a TV show? I, I think I pop up on YouTube more often than I did before the TV show, okay. which is cool. Um, yeah, I it doesn't change that much. Uh, I, I go to, I get, I get in, instead of just going to cons now, I get invited to go to cons. Which is awesome. And that's cool, because, uh, you know, it's like, hey, you want to come to a con in Miami? Yeah. <laughs> so here I am. Uh, that's cool. I, um, I like travel a lot to go to the cons, so I make it a point to try to hit all the local comic book shops wherever I am. Okay. And um, it's cool, you get a little better service because uh, most of the store owners I've seen the show, they like the show. They they feel the same pains, you know, seeing that we went through on TV. And they appreciate with, you know people bringing in stuff to sell on TV, and they want like a million bucks for it. Yeah. And it's like, no, like we'll give you three dollars for this because it's beef to hell. So that's cool, and, we, and um, you know we feel certain kinship. So. 
we usually have like long conversations about the, the business or or you know I walk around the city with some new friends so Which is I think awesome. that's that might be the biggest change I have a lot more new friends now so yeah it's cool and I get to talk to guys like you which oh, is awesome yeah. so uh, what's where where can we find you? What do you got going on now? I uh, me and Mike opened up a podcast studio. I don't know if you podcast. If you don't, you should. I, I do know. Podcast. Okay, yeah, perfect. I podcast. So we um, we noticed everybody wanted to start a podcast, but they had nowhere to do it, and they didn't want to buy all the gear. Did you know the gear is a pain in the ass? And uh, and no one wanted to mess with the technical details. Like where do I upload this? How do I put artwork? How do I get it on iTunes? You don't have to worry about that. You come to our place, which is called A Shared Universe, and we take care of all that for you. So, uh, you know, with this growing, I don't even think it's a trend. I think it's a new medium that's going to last for a long time. And But people need a place to just come and podcast and not worry about all that other stuff. That's what we give them. So, And then I go to, I still go to all the cons on the weekend. So, yeah. yeah. Yeah, we know from the show you were always asking to go to cons. Yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, and I, I, I don't even think you have to ask permission. No, I just, just I, doing I, it truly, now. I love it. I truly enjoy it. Yeah. As do you, and I, I love seeing people cosplay. I love seeing people geek out. I just, I love that you know they can drop the episode nine trailer, and and everybody watches, drops whatever they're doing, and they watch it, and they speculate on it, and they debate about it, and, uh, and and it's a long way until December until we see the movie. But I can't wait. It's like everybody has breakdowns for the new Star oh, yeah. Wars. Yeah. Yep. You type in Star Wars, and there's like a thousand videos with everybody giving their comments. Right. And even though you know I came up with the name, you know, Rise of Skywalker. What does that mean? What does it mean? We thought Luke Skywalker is dead, right? But what, what you know, what? Uh, where's the reigning Skywalker? I don't know. So yeah, it's, it's gonna be awesome. All right, awesome. Well, thank you, Ming, so much for your time. Yeah, no problem, and, man. Uh, Check it. Tune in Entertainment, man. Tune in Entertainment. There you go. All right, thank you. Of course.